Good morning. You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Jeffrey Parrish. Today is Friday, June 8th, and here's what's in the news. The Wall Street Journal reports the Treasury Department issued new rules making it more difficult for the U.S. firms to move to low-tax countries as the debate over U.S. business tax policy grows. The Wall Street Journal also reports Dish Network Chairman Charlie Ergen says a new ad-skipping feature that has infuriated major TV broadcast networks is a competitively necessary response to the explosion of cheap Internet video. The Wall Street Journal also reports Spain is expected to request European aid for its ailing banks this weekend to forestall worsening market turmoil, becoming the largest country to seek assistance since the Eurozone's debt crisis began. Reuters reports GM's troubled Opel unit looks to increase sale volumes in China sixfold to 30,000, its CEO told German newspaper Hanselblatt, as it seeks to offset its shrinking home market. Bloomberg reports as Europe's sovereign debt crisis grows, depositors are increasingly putting their money in saving German banks. Deposits there jumped 4.4 percent to $2.73 trillion as of April 30th from a year earlier, according to European Central Bank figures. For more updates, keep it right here to the Financial News Network. This has been What's in the News today, Friday, June 8th.